Good morning. It's day three of our Disney Dream Cruise and we are just now docking at Disney's Castaway Key. So they, you might hear a few blasts. They're shooting out the stuff to uh, be able to dock us in. I'll try and put that video in here as well for you too so you can see that process. It's a really cool one. Um, but Jonathan and the big kids have the banana boats today. I'm gonna stay back with Nat for a little bit because water's just not really my thing, but I'm excited to see them do it. Tonight is pirate night, so we're really, really excited. Although you saw us have dinner at Animator's Palette last night, we're going back there again tonight, but it will be a different menu because of the theming for today. So we're really, really stoked for that. While we kinda got a little dressy, it's, it's not over the top, but we'll have our bandanas that they'll give us a little later. You'll see that too. Um, but as fabulous as the first two days have been, I can only imagine what tonight's going to look like. So go ahead, strap in, come along for the ride. Let's go. Castaway Key. It's right about 7.30 ish. Close to, if not just a little after. Looks like we're turning. So that way we can go ahead and see about docking. Now they're going to undock everybody first from the crew so that way they can get the island ready. But you can see this is where we're going to undock from. Going to catch all the uh, trams and stuff over that way. Let's see. I'm not seeing the trail because we're a little further out, but you can see some of the umbrellas that they're already getting set up and everything over that way. So I'm really excited. This docking procedure is rather fascinating. They're blasting out these, I want to say ribbons, but ties right here so they can tie everything down. I wonder if they'll catch them doing it one more time. Look, Deb, you see that trail through there? What? You see that trail through there? Yeah. It's the trail that the trams are going to take to take us out towards the beaches and stuff. Oh. Rain on is almost gone, though. Ah, uh, yeah. It looks like it's going to start clearing up here with the rain real soon. Whoa, what is it? Just kind of from? passing through. I don't know. There it goes. Oh, they missed. You have to do another. Mm -hmm. There it goes. Too far, but too far is better than not enough. That's pretty cool, isn't it? And there go the straps. Pretty nifty. is coming to life cute all right guys this is it uh, we can go to three we can go midship but then uh, we're going down we're gonna get out on castaway key Mickey hand oh it's downstairs looks like the Mickey mobile is getting a complete wash down but hey Nat it's your first time out of the country look they're already starting to do some ship maintenance Looks like they're doing some good work over there to the Disney Dream. We just docked here at Castaway Key. As you can see, you can walk this way if you'd prefer to walk, but I think we're gonna take the tram, so the tram looks pretty full for now. And we're gonna wait on the next one. But I'm excited to get this party started. When you're done for the day, the towel return is right here by the tram stop, so you wanna make sure that you don't miss that because it'll be important. It might be one of your last ones before you get back on board. Okay, so here is the Castaway Key Island map. Right here you can see it's where we've docked in. Then you'll walk a little bit there out to like 17. That's the tram stop for cargo handling. Then that tram is gonna go along this whole route through here. It's gonna make two different stops. One a little bit further out and one closer in. Right over this way is the Serenity Bay. 
right back here on this further side. Family beaches are gonna be out by here. I don't know if Scuttles Cove is open again just yet, but uh, the kids and Jonathan have a banana boat ride at 11, so I'm interested to see how that all pans out. And then Z right here is the observation tower. So we'll go up there a little bit later, take some photos, look out from there too. As you see everybody else coming in, there are several different photo opportunities. So make sure that if that's something that you want to go ahead and get, you might want to try and get those ahead of time, like as you're coming in, because you might have some island here uh, after you've been out in the water for a little bit. Otherwise, you can stop as you're coming back onto the ship and uh, take your photos then. It does look like Scuttles Cove is open, so that is the Kids Club. Hi! I don't know. So if you're looking to check your kids in here, they can come in here and play to their heart's content. But right now, we've got bigger fish to fry, or should I say cheese, to catch, because there's Minnie Mouse! Look how beautiful she is! We have our heading, I mean, our seating. <laughs> we've made it out to the family beach. I'm ready to get the kids to dive on in. Oh, this looks so fantastic. We'll get you floating. Well, let's set up They're right over here. Floaties are right over here. We'll get you one. Okay, the kids got the Cajun chicken, the ear of corn, burger, chips, drinks. I got the Texas cornbread hot dog as well. We've already gotten into the ice cream Every again. Kind of <laughs> Every kind of fruit and pineapple. Is that mango? Papaya. Papaya that you could possibly want. And then Jonathan even got some of the macaroni salads. So I'm interested to see how well these do. Oh, those big cookies too. Oh man, this is awesome. And we might have to try one of these frozen drinks later because they come in those super cool souvenir cups. Dev left me his hat. So I think at this point what we're gonna do is I'm gonna take Natalie back. 
we're gonna relax, build some sand castles or sand somethings. And then once the big kids are done snorkeling, I'm gonna trade off the chopping and try and snorkel myself. So, we've got a couple more hours still left, not too many, but uh, we're gonna make the best of every moment that we have here. Kendall and I are about ready to run the weirdest 5K of our lives. With flip flops and ice cream in hand. It'll be so much fun. Let's do it. We also have a bike rental for an hour and yeah, I don't know that we're actually gonna be able to do that, but that's the other Pelican Plunge. This is Pelican Beach. And we're doing it, doing the 5K. Woo, 5K finish. <laughs> oh man, I think my feet are a little tired now. What about you? My feet are... Feet hurt? Uh -uh. I'm sorry. Ah, there's the other tramp stop. I think we're gonna take the boys bike rentals though. So anyone under 18 has to wear a helmet. So Kendall's grabbing her helmet right now. I'm taking Jocelyn's bike rental, don't tell him. <laughs> Sand in it, I'm sorry. Uh, it's okay, we got this. All right, so it's your last moment in the Bahamas. You want to come back? Dude, she snorkeled her butt off. Okay, I think 
we're all a little like spent for Castaway Key, but it's been fantastic. <laughs> you'll, you'll have to learn about that one. But uh, Matt had such a fun time. All the big kids went banana boating and snorkeling and they had a blast. Nat made new friends. I may have forgotten to reapply sunscreen as recommended a couple times. The food at Cookies was phenomenal. Um, it was just all around such a great time out. Um, but we've only really got about 45 minutes, an hour or so before we were due back on the ship anyway. So we're just done. We're spent. Uh, but we're going to go ahead, get washed up. Thank goodness we don't have main dining because we would have dinner in like an hour, <laughs> hour and a half. So um, at least we'll have some time to wash off, take a nap, relax, and then go to dinner. But remember, tonight's Pirates Night, so I'm really excited to see what they have up their sleeves for us on the menu. So stay tuned. More to come. Bye, Castaway Key. Look, somebody's still parasailing. Oh my goodness. They're gonna have to parasail. They're like, I'm taking the express route home. <laughs> It's funny the things you see here. We got Captain Bob Iger over here. And then just up ahead, you might see a few more familiar names. This is the Bahamian Mail Center here if you wanted to mail some things. But look who we got over here. Damaro Dock and Bob Chapek, Master Ship Builder. Wow. Looks like everybody's hard at work getting ready to set up for pirate night. We've already seen a few cast members out in their pirate outfits, but the stage is looking pretty nifty. All right, we're gonna try out a pirate's life for me here in the D Lounge. Let's see what they got here. I think they're gonna spin for some treasure.
going to be a different menu for Pirate Night, so let's take a look at what we got on the menu. Aren't you cute? <laughs> you look fearsome, Devin. I love it. Got Kendall and festivities there, too. Look at Nat. She's getting ready to get hers on, but she's getting ready to color. We've already got our bread service for the day. Extra butter. Yep, Natalie's got her hat, but check this out. Oh man, instead of finding the motor day, we got all things pirate themed. It looks so, so good through here. Let's take a look around. Wow. Don't tell him, Carlos. Don't be chicken. Speaking of which, that's exactly what I got. Tia Dama's jerk chicken. Carlos. Jonathan goes, or Devin goes, look, it's Carlos. It is Carlos, right there on the very top. Can you see him? Oh, a hen for a hen. Show him your feathers, dearie. Or strike your feathers, dearie. Show him your flock. Quite possibly one of the greatest attractions ever to roam the earth. Not unless she be laying them 
golden egg. And they still have the redhead in here. Interesting. Okay, Devin and me and Jonathan decided to order the Virgin Bahama Mamas. Natalie's like, oh, there's lights in that. So, yes, Nat, there is. There is definitely lights in that. You want to try it? Just take the paper off the top of the straw. Fruit punch, yeah. Oh, do we keep the cup? I think we get to keep the cup, yeah. Eight bucks for a cup and a drink, that's not bad. It tastes like orange juice. Tastes like orange juice? Yeah, it's definitely like a fruity drink. Yeah. Is it okay? Do you like it? Very cool. Very cool. Look, you've got a red one, Devin's got a blue one, and Kendall's got a green one. You can change the colors and make them. I'm sure, but that's how she was kind of, Rosanna was kind of keeping them different there. Jonathan says the crab cakes are good, but I opted in for the cream of chicken soup. Hi! Seeking adventure and salty old pirates, eh? Well, you come to the proper place. Tonight, you be traveling in mysterious waters. Waters once owned by tales of plenty of pirates and the ones who hunted them. Some say when the night is right and the sea is willing, these scoundrels will once again sail the sea.
follow my orders in the face of danger, or even sudden death. Say that! ahead. Here's luck and a fair wind to you. And remember, dead men tell no tales.
Cross. <laughs> That's cool. It's gotta be from the camera way up there. Okay, after all that pirate partying, we came back to, I think it's Davy Jones. You can see he's got his chocolate gold coin, says dead men tell no tales. That side has skull and crossbones, but if we go back out to the other room, they've got a monkey. Look how cute that is. And Nat's already totally out. Devin's probably still at the kids club getting ready to check out, so I think we're going to call it a night too. Okay, everybody, thank you so much for joining our adventures here for Pirates in the Caribbean with Mickey and his pals. We are now officially part of that pirate crew. Uh, thank you so much for joining us for a, another action-packed day. Please don't hesitate a bit to make sure that you are subscribed right there. Hit that notification bell. Make sure that that's uh, intact for you as well so you don't miss a beat of our next adventures. We're hoping to have the uh, last day's video up for you as well uh, tomorrow so that way you uh, can finish out our whole journey. And then, of course, we'll show you a little bit of embarkation day but we still have one more day left to go so we're zonked we're gonna call it a night maybe sh you know shovel down our uh, dessert that we had to go from dinner and uh, see where everything takes us tomorrow so with that we're gonna call it a night and we'll catch you guys on the next ride bye everybody